Greetings ladies and gentlemen, your favorite KZR user Romic here and today we have one of the most fun decks in the current meta and since Wave will probably get nerfed to some way, shape or form and Mobius will release next week, let's play KZR Turbo. And yes, this is a jump scare KZR list since we're just gonna be playing like this. So we wanna open with stuff like Sunspot maybe and then in case we don't draw something we're just gonna sit on them, pretend we're playing nothing particular. And then we try to play Angela, Bishop, Kazar, Blue Marvel, and then on the final turn, drop like five or six one drops and just instantly kill our opponent. That is the play that this deck is trying to do. Now we have outs for a lot of stuff. We have Electra against specific matchups like, you know, when that always high evolutionary has the nebulas, the sunspots. She can just be like a 110 sometimes. Nightcrawler is just good at getting locations we can't get into. Squirrel Girl is just big and that's always good. Blade is just here as a zero placement just in case you don't have them. They do the same role, you just play them out of the hand. And on the final turn, which means they have no downsides. And of course Iron Fist to get into hard to reach locations. With the stuff like Bishop in case you need to use them. And of course Kazar and Blue Marvel to round it out. If you don't have Kazar and Blue Marvel you retreat. But now make sure to like, comment and subscribe. We're trying to get to 1000 subscribers as soon as possible so I can make the big bucks. And let's get snapping. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna get to rank 1 with Kazar. Because he boosts 1 cost cards and we're gonna become the... Well, number 1 Marvel Snap player. Loki be damned. I'm gonna show it off. Like, the only thing we lose to is, like, Wave on the final turn, which is pretty bad. I mean, okay, we have Blue Marvel, which means we probably won't be retreating. I'll just be sitting on this. This is... This is fine. Okay, Sunspot means this is probably High Evolutionary. Okay, they got screwed from the Super Flow. That's still fine. Okay. We continue to bait them to thinking we're playing Galactus or something. Okay, they want to give us armor? Sure. Why wouldn't we play cards? Maybe this is Shuri, actually. But you know what? Fine, I will play armor. Oh my god, that's pretty bad. I'll play armor... I'll play armor and Ant-Man left. I know it looks like... Oh my, why are you telling him? But... I kind of have to, since if I don't, we're just kind of dead on board. If they wave. Can't just let them do it for free. Okay, now I will just... Do I Bishop into Electra right now? Yeah, sure. I like this. Yeah, I thought so. High Evolutionary. Yeah, I thought he would try to fill up my hand. This is way better. Electro American Sniper's mid. Well, Blue Marvel and Bar Sinister is pretty good. Do I snap here? I think I do. Yeah, I like this. I doubt they play Enchantress, so let's hope they don't. Professor X right would be a problem, but I doubt they do that. Like, that sounds really... Bad and stupid. And the fact they didn't even put Jeff into this deck shows that I'm just going for the free-to-play options for all of you guys. I have to. You guys love the free-to-play decks, so I always try to perform as good as I can. I don't think he knows. Maybe he does. Wave. Ah, oh, and there we go. I'm probably dead, actually. Yeah, this card is just like... It, it's quite broken. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Uh, n not much. Not much beats Wave. I mean, Squirrel Girl is pretty good. I guess. I mean, she does it. With one card, I do get to win. They'll play left, so they get Ant-Man's power ability, but I can't really do much else. I kinda have a cold guy so I apologize for the nostril action you can hear but eh, I think I'm, I sound pretty fine. They'll move Jeff left so they get the Ant-Man buff and then they will play Hulk mid. That is that is my like laser line that I'm thinking of. 
Oh my god, we be we beat even wave with this deck. Like even though this is the like meta counter, the most broken card in the game at the moment, aside from of course Galactus. It's fine. It's fine. We can do it. And Loki. Don't make don't make me forget Loki. Like Loki doesn't really beat us, mostly because our deck is just like really cheap garbage that he can't use. Unless he gets Kazar, Blue Marvel, and then everything else. Yeah, then it's pretty bad. Loki is the best deck in the game, followed up like Galactus Alio and High Evolutionary. So if they nerf Galactus Alio and Loki, but they keep High Evolutionary free, <sighs> we're dead. Oh my god. 4444, four, four, four. That, that's the number of the beast in Japan, great. Okay, we have Kazar, which means this is probably gonna go well. Death's Domain is... Eh, it could be better. There is Sunspot to be an asshole again. Let's hope we open Angela. No, okay. Electra, American Sniper, the Sunspot, I'm in. Of course we lost the 50-50 for priority. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe this keeps working. Stupid Electra just keeps getting the opponent like a dumbass. Okay, we're up against High Evolutionary, I'm guessing. Like, that's the only thing that comes to mind. Yeah, what else would they be playing? Now he's gonna Cyclops right and be like, Oh my god, I'm such a genius. Yawn! Yawn! Yawn. That's all I have to say. Yawn. He's got Professor X left. Some part of me just knows it, but you know what? If he does it, so be it. I can't risk Kazar dying. No, he's gonna do it right. Okay, Doctor Doom, actually. Funnily enough, we can overpower this. Unless he Odin's mid, we can still do this. If he hits like hits the Giddy and gets Enchantress mid, we're kind of dead. Iron Lad into Professor X. It's always that, right? What the fuck is that? Oh, we're up against Patriot. Is there a chance to win? Why do I feel like there is? Okay, so we... I doubt he plays Odin. Jesus Christ. Okay, I can probably do this. I feel like I can... So I better... I better not disappoint the viewers at home. Okay, okay, we can do this. We can do this! This into this. Into this. Into this. This should be enough. That's five. That's free. Like, I think I did- yeah, I thought he would move Jeff, let's hope it's not like... Don't hit left, please. Okay. Ah, so close. One power left, almost. Nah, there was just no way. Was there? Yeah, I'm thinking nah, there wasn't, sadly. If we played Nightcrawler one turn early, we could have done it, but he just can't. It, it was, it, it's a pretty tough matchup. Yeah, they had an insane opener. I did my best, guys, but you know, that's what happens when, like, you don't draw Angela early. Like, you need, you need the broken stuff. Okay, Bishop can do it. Like, we have a, okay, this is a more amazing hand. I don't like Loran Central in this meta, but you know what, it's fine. <laughs> oh, Nebula again. Ugh, I'm getting tired of this. This meta. Ugh. Is this what's gonna keep happening? Just like every time we have one viable deck, High Evolutionary just goes and ruins everything again. Well, Central Park's pretty good for us. 
I'll actually just play bishop mid. Wow, the same deck. It's not the same deck, Romek. He's playing different cards. This time he has a silk engine in there. Wow. So interesting. How do you... How do you do it? <laughs> How did you do this? How did you find it? That's a chucking cringe, dude. Oh, Angela Nightcrawler. Oh, it's a, it's it's different, Romek. Romek, it's completely different. It's not at all like the other decks. This one's completely different. This time we're playing a different engine. Oh, my, it's like it's always the same fucking thing. It's just the same fucking thing. <laughs> like, don't you dare lie to me for a second that this deck is any different than all the other bullshit decks you keep seeing. It's always the same shit. It's never different. <laughs> like, how evolutionary Angela move, it's always the same garbage. Please move left. Thank you. Wow, that is actually really good. We might win from that. Now we have no cards that we did. If we discard, we lose. Don't be... Okay, Electra, at least snipe the Nightcrawler, okay? Nope, the worst target. Okay. Well, they're not clogged anymore. Let's try to do the... Make the best of our... Well, Squirrel Girl here is kind of mid. Well, we Rocket mid. We Iron Fist, right? We Blade and we Squirrel Girl and we pray to Jesus that it's enough. Like, I, th I think it's enough. And if I think that's enough, so should you. Not even Alioth could beat us here. Probably it could. Whatever. <laughs> like, whatever. We let's hope. Chavez. Oh, wow. In the best possible position. At least Angela powers up and we win anyway. But Jesus Christ. Wait. It's not over yet. Hand empty. Squirrel girl. Where will she go? Well, we win anyway. Four more cubes for us. What a insane. Like, this was the previous best deck in the game, and we whipped him like the boy he is. I mean, we did get the perfect curve. There we go. Angela, uh, Blue Marble, Kazar, we had everything. Let's keep going. The deck is as amazing as I thought it would be. I mean, Kazar Turbo is really good. In this meta specifically, like, if Wave wasn't, like, in the best decks in the game, if Wave wasn't as oppressive as she always is, I mean, I love Wave as, like, a hand trap, but you know what I hate Wave in High Evolutionary? Like, High Evolutionary destroys everything. What a stupid card. I legitimately hate that card. There is nothing good about half the designs in that. that I can't. I just can't. I hate it. Like, Luke Cage is annoying. Oh, well. We might get overpowered by this card just having an insane blade into Double Swarm. I mean, we'll do our best. Since I have no good on reveals, I'll just Angela. Mid. And pretend that I have some busted stuff to use. Okay, the kill means I kind of have to go early. Morbius. I'll... I'll do a bit of a prediction. You know what? Okay, that's fine. It doesn't look fine, but if they'll Dracula right, I'm guessing, or something of the sort. Gambit, hopefully hitting the Nightcrawl. You know what? Still fine. It's not that bad. I think. Like, it could be better, but you know, it could also be worse. Uh, just in case, we need to get some preparations going. I can play all five of these. Should I do it right now? Depending on the top deck, yeah, the, I, I should better go in. Like, yeah, if we top deck Bishop, it's pretty bad, but what do I do? I can't wait that long. 
If I wait that long, I'll just be dead. And then, and then what does it matter? Whatever I played didn't matter, really. I'll do Iron Fist into Blade, since I'd rather not have to worry about it going left. And this spreads the power. In a way. Lady Sif discarding Wolverine. Okay. And another Swarm. Well, he can't really play them much. Goddamn, that Morbius is, is so huge though. Jesus Christ, man, their hand is insane. Well, Blade is dead. We Rocky Raccoon off mid. Granting him and him being a 1-9 in terms of power. Squirrel Girl shoving the squirrels everywhere. Kabamo. Like, Blue Marvel could do it if we top deck him. Iron Fist and Blade finally discarding nothing and jumping left. Please be Blue Marvel. Like, Blue Marvel is pretty good. Okay, that. I mean, we're still dead. Yeah, no way I'm beating that. Sorry, guys, he kind of had a little too much. <laughs> like, come on. Kamar, Taj, Gambit, Lady Sif, Coiling Wing. Yeah, he doesn't care. Like, yeah, all in his, all the things in his hand are swarms, but it's too much. We didn't have. A, he killed Angela. If we had Angela, we win. Bishop, we win too. Yeah, not much you can do against that. Just too much. Kamar, Taj, Gambit, just at the right time, destroying everything. Lady Sif, the, the highest cost card in his hand was Wolverine. One America Chavez and we're dead, so yeah, this there's no winning this. Well, let's not int if we're gonna play for ball uh, play for keeps. No point in like throwing the game outside the window. Just for like, yeah, maybe if I draw a blue marble, maybe I won't. This is the worst location possible. There is no worst location. This is the only one we specifically can't play into. So this is probably up against move. Well... I mean, Kazar is fine. I'll play Angela. Kazar Blue Marvel is pretty good since I can mostly shove down the rest of the power everywhere else. Shuri? Feels like Shuri to me. We pass. This is why Sunspot's in here. Just in case we don't draw anything. Oh! This is the Destroyer. That's what it is. No wonder I found it familiar. We Keza into Blue Marvel into hopefully some better drops. <laughs> this is not the best hand ever. Namor. Yeah, this is Professor X all the time. God damn, that is the worst one, isn't it? Professor X right is so good. I can't beat it. I have to do this. Because I can't pressure the other lanes. If I don't. Like, yeah, Namor's big and strong, but I need... I'll probably draw Squirrel Girl or something. Come on, game. Help me out a little. You give me the worst location possible. Can you at least give me something to follow along with it? Yeah, oh my god. Professor X, I'm gonna play Lockdown! I'm so good at the game! Like, fuck off, man. God! Professor X! Oh, Iron Man, wow. Miracle, the miracle of science. Come on, Squirrel Girl! No, uh, Well, you know, it's pretty bad, but you know what's worse? Not trying to win. Do I have any plays worth doing? Is there a reason to stay? You bet your ass there is. So, what are we gonna do? Okay, okay, watch this. I don't know how much power is this. <clears throat> Let's see, it's enough. Okay, how much power is this? Enough. I'll now rock it, raccoon. And I'll hope he copes and goes into Nemo. <laughs> that is my only line. I have to, like, make him think I'm gonna play left. Or I really can't. Mm, it's best I can do. Are you s This is so stupid. 
Wow, well, Spectrum is literally the best thing. Yeah. Dude legitimately moved his Nightcrawler right, and we were still gonna lose. Like, he's so bad at the game, <laughs> we're still gonna lose. Ah, oh, that is just... Like, we would have won every step of the way, but... No, Crimson Cosmos. Eh. Romek, you should have left. Dude, we had Squirrel Girl, Iron Fist. There was no reason to think that we're not gonna play Ultron or something. Like, we look like a Patriot deck. Come on. He's just so bad. He's so bad. I think that was a bot. It probably was. Man is literally the worst player ever and he still wins. Jesus Christ. I mean, all the locations worked for him, so I guess he doesn't really care, but Jesus Christ, that was so bad. So bad. 20 euro... This turbo. I don't know what that is supposed to mean. The opponent probably thinks it's like, that's the most clever name ever. He's probably playing Loki also, which means he's pretty cringe, you know? And that is a, this is a cringy man. Attilan is actually horrible, because I'm supposed to sleep on my cards. Oh, Angela, right? Oh my god, not this shit again! Oh, fuck. You know what? Electra. Electra, go get the gun. Electra, go shoot her with your gun. Take the gun. Whoosh. Slap her with it. My god, what a... <laughs> fuck. Nebula, Romic is so based. I like that you like Nebula. People just don't get sarcasm. <laughs> like, I cannot believe people were even thinking I was actually serious when I said that. Me, always says, like, Nebula is one of the most terribly designed cards ever in the history of card games. Like, yeah, you either play here or die. Basically, that's Nebula's text. And people are like, yeah, Romic, that's amazing. I love Nebula too. What do you like about her? I want to know. I'm very interested. Bro's gonna bring out Wave or some bullshit like that. Cyclops, you know what? That's perfectly fine. You know what's the sad part now? I either play Blue Marvel and get one shot by wave or I do this and still get one shot by wave. It's truly a game where nobody wins. He's now gonna wave and he's gonna be like, yeah, I'm gonna Jeff into wave. Wave, wow, amazing. He's so good. He's so good, guys! Funnily enough, this is not the worst. Well, he's forced to play, right? Yeah. Wow, oh my god, we won. Oh my god, we won. Dude, I like this is so such an unfair card. Such an unfair card in the meta, oh my god, like. I mean, it's not like it's... I don't like it. I like it being used in High Evolutionary. Here's, here's like an idea, guys. We make a limited and banned list. And we're like, if you play Wave, you can't play High Evolutionary. Like, you, you realize what I'm trying to do? Like, you're forced to play cards somewhere. Like, you can't play them willy-nilly, like Duel Links. That's how you balance the game. So not every deck can just be like, here are the best cards in the game and the best newest cards in the game. So you just like make a... Wow, Lake Hellas is amazing. I'll wait one turn so my opponent doesn't know. I have to do that. Watch them have Nebula again. Craven. Okay, that means we're up against uh, Tempo Move. Wow, sitting on our asses has been profitable. Okay. This is fine. And they will now Silk or some bullshit like that. I hope we just get Blue Marvel or something. Like, they don't play Wave, do they? Forge Craven. Okay, Kazar. We die to wave. Like everyone does. Is this gonna be Captain Marvel? No, no, not Captain Marvel. Is this gonna be now wave shenanigans? If it's wave, then God fuck, fuck. That's all I can say, fuck. Can't beat that shit.
Please. Okay. Wow, we have a chance. Well, here we go. It's time to pop off. Okay. Here. Uh, actually... Jesus Christ. Yeah, yeah, like the squirrel... I wish I could just, like, replace card where it go. Like, <laughs> that was English. Trust me. <laughs> Trust me, bro. But, okay. Squirrel Girl goes there. Nightcrawler goes here. Iron Fist goes here. Blade goes here. We probably win. Pop off, boys. Like, this pressures the Captain Marvel to such a degree where she will have to be... Amazing. Alioth? Heimdall, actually. I think we win. No, we do not. Captain Marvel will take a right. I think. Yeah. Yeah, she's enough. God damn it, dude. That's so frustrating. Yeah, there was no reason to... One power off. Ah, uh, that's so frustrating. That is legitimately so frustrating. It legitimately hit all of their hand. Oh my god, dude. Heimdall wasn't even good there, but... The guess it just did not punish them. They didn't even know what they were playing against. They were just like, yeah, Heimdall, why? I don't know. We need to draw the Angel, that's why I put her in. And we need to draw Bishop earlier. Like, it all would have been fine. Now nah, we're just gonna sit on uh, sit on our asses, wondering and thinking about life. Ah, uh, the, the opponent always has her, doesn't he? They always have her. How? How do they always seem to draw her? You know what? I'm gonna do something special this time. Bro's running Ravona, the worst card in the game. Like, one of the legitimately worst cards in the game. Well, this doesn't help, but this is at least... Possibly a draw. Well, you know what? If we're gonna, gonna go for a possible draw, let's get Squirrel Girl out. Oh my god! Yay! Dark Hawk! Woo! I love it! Woo! More Dark Hawk! Yeah, Dark Hawk! Woo! I love Dark Hawk, he's my favorite, Romek, I love him! Fuck off, dude. Every single time we get a new card, it's always Hawk! It's always Hawk! It's just Hawk again! <laughs> yeah, it's Dark Hawk, but Romek, this time it's different! I'm putting Ravona into Hawk! <laughs> Oh my god! Bro gets Lechugila also! Like, fuck off! <laughs> fuck right off! Yeah! Hawk! <laughs> There's the Hawk! I love Hawk! Rolling, don't you wanna play Hawk? No, I don't! I hate this card! Oh my god, Christ almighty! God, give me a break here! What are the chances we win? Zip. Okay. You know what? You know what? It's minute... How much is it? Minute 27. You know what? I got a Steam notification. Who cares? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna play it all out. I'm gonna show it off. I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be retreating. Because there's no way we win. <laughs> like, they run Killmonger. They run all that shit. Hey, Budget Zabu, how are you doing today? That's Ravona, basically. D Stop coping and telling me, Love it, Ravona's good if you play her in Dark Hawk. Bro, anything is good in Dark Hawk. It's the best core in the game. It's just free cards that does everything. Alone, like, they're just good. They're just good. So stop telling me it's good. I'm mad whenever you guys tell me he's good. No, like, it's a good card. Ravona is shit. Horrible card. 
does li less than nothing. So stop grilling me about it and telling me that it's good. No, it's not. It's terrible. God. Oh, great. Another Jeff user. Hello, High Evolution. You know what? That's not too bad. You know what? You know what? That That's fine. Kind of. He will now play Cyclops because of course he fucking will! They always fucking draw it. Oh my god. How does, how is he so good that he always draws the fucking thing? Oh god. Dude. Why is this better than most things? You know what? Fine. He will now the thing left. Watch him, of course. Why wouldn't he? He drew it. He is God himself. God, I, I hate this. The fact that I have to play... Yay! We won't even get to play. Oh, it hits the only two that can move out of the... <laughs> Amazing job, second dinner. Amazing work. Can we get Blue Marvel? Holy shit, we can. What are the chances we win? You know what? You know what? I'm willing to go. Even further beyond of my usual ability. A boom. Kill not Professor X, right. Keza! Rocket Raccoon predicting the opponent and shooting him with his gun. Now he will wave or something. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, baby! That's what he's been waiting for. You know what? Boom! Eat him alive! Wait, Alioth is kind of bad, but you know... Most things are really bad here. I don't care. I'm standing my ground. I'm standing my ground. I'll bait him into thinking it's Alio. Like he needs to Alio this exactly. I'll be bait like, yeah, it's America Chavez, trust. <laughs> it's not America. Well, let's hope it is. If he plays Killmonger, then god damn it, there's nothing I can do. I won 8 cubes against Wave High Evolutionary. Go suck it, dude. Snapowski more like Krakowski. You can't win this. On reveal, you lose more like... I uh, You lose... Yeah, what a comeback. Tell him, boys. Tell him, did we get to rank 3000? Ah, we'll play one more. Almost to rank 3000 with just Kzar. This is... This is going well. So far, we haven't really lost a lot. I mean, we lost some games where I'm just testing the deck out. I'm trying to see how it works, but... This deck has a lot of potential, because when Wave gets nerfed, that's when the, this deck will strike. Like, this is a hidden, broken deck, is what I'm trying to guys, tell you. I'm trying to guys tell you. <laughs> what the fuck am I seeing? Oh, great. I'm up I'm probably against Destroy since they snapped on Chloe Watts. Watch this be Sunspot or something. And they'll just be like, hello, I am high evolutionary with, oh, 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 dude. Can you quit it? How do they always draw, watch, collector is in his hand. It's always in their hand. Quinjet, collector, Loki, Angela, always in their hand. Watch, watch, I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna snap, but I'm just gonna show Quinjet, okay. Snow Guard, okay, dude has already part of the broken combo, okay. Let's keep going. Wow. That's a great idea. Oh, fuck, fuck me, dude. Bro drew it. He actually did it. He has another Loki. Well, at least my deck isn't that good when it's stolen. I mean, could be worse. Okay, Zar left. 
And then just try to like shit out an entire board on the final turn. That's all I can do. Damn, dude, though. Double Quinjet Loki. God, he can just play Blue Marvels for free now. Yeah, ah, Blue Marvels for free if he got him. Plus, Loki is one mana. Yeah, I'm really starting to hate all these Sarah effects. I'm just gonna say that. Here's a Sunspot into Loki. He didn't play Blue Marvel. Maybe he didn't get it. Oh, he's replacing his entire grip. Mirage. He got... Things. Could be a lot of things. Could be not a lot of things. Well, he really flooded Conlon. There's still a chance we can do it. Like, yeah, he has to sleep on Sunspot. Which is the, like, advantage we need to press. Yay. Hmm, is Blue Marvel better? Hmm, I don't know. I don't really know here. There's a lot of plays that need to be done. Yeah, there's a lot of things I need to do to win, actually. He probably stole my Blue Marvel, so or it's not like the game fucking matters. What am I even talking about? Like, yeah, wow, Iron Fist. Well, he flooded. Ugh, well, yeah, he does play Electra. That is my card. He will now Blue Mar uh, Sunspot Blue Marvel, right? Loki again. Dude is just... Throwing out Loki for fun. Now watch him get five mana of <laughs> Warp of Sunspot. Like, watch! It's gotta be so stupid. <laughs> so dumb! It's so dumb, but he gets to do it anyway! <laughs> I really hate it. Well, I mean, best I can do. Yeah, like, this probably wins. I'm throwing down the gauntlet. I'm flicking the shit switch. I'm turning up the diarrhea dial. We just beat Loki. We just beat the best deck in the game with Kzar Turbo. I legitimately cannot believe. W what did he get? What, what, what did you go into? Anyway, let's go to deck and let's talk about how good this deck actually is. Like, yeah, the moment this deck get like, the moment Wave gets nerfed, or Mobius, like, Mobius! Mobius could be the key! You can replace, I don't know, Bishop, maybe. Like, eh, maybe you can replace a one-drop or something. But yeah, the moment you get Mobius, you suddenly can't lose on turn 6, uh, Outlines of Sandman. Like, we just drop a gazillion power. If you get, like, Sunspot, Angel, Bishop, snap, dude. And if you get also a Kzar and Blue Marble, the game ends. This... Deck is almost impossible to outpower on turn 6, but what do you lose to? Hello, Killmonger. You lose to if you uh, commit too early, your opponent waits for the Killmonger, and somehow you have priority on the earlier turns. Yeah, that's the way you lose. Outside, there's probably no way to lose. This deck is really, really, really good. I cannot believe I'm saying that a Kzar deck is just really good in our year of 2023. It's almost 2024, and Kzar is still good. Pool 1? Nah. This is Pool 5. Like, <laughs> we're in Pool 5 in high tier. Infinite, we can win with Kzar. I can't believe it. I'm actually really happy that the deck performed well. But I was Romic for today, your favorite host of the Snap Media. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you! in the Snap Mania. Take care, everyone.